Hi, you're watching Crystal Vibes TV, your favorite entertainment blog house in Ghana, West Africa, and the whole world at large. If you like our videos, please subscribe, like, and share. Moses Uyo Enang, popularly known as Moses Blees, is actually a Nigerian gospel singer, gospel artist that has actually taken over the stage. Yes, he has taken over the stage for Jesus, not for himself. He's not shining for himself, but to the glory of the Lord. And we are so proud to have him, to have someone like him in the gospel music industry. He has done a lot. Within the short time, he has done a whole lot. And so many things has happened in his life because, yes, he has actually been dragged left, right, and center. But in all, he has still been coming back with more strength and better and better and better sounds. Yes, if you know sounds like Miracle No the Tired Jesus, Bigger Every Day, Too Faithful was the sound that actually took him viral. Like, there's no way you listen to that song and you will not want to, like, you know, worship God, back in the aura of the faithfulness of God. Like, that song was actually a song that came from a place of, um, you know, when you have this deep knowing of the God that you serve. And if you listen to Moses Blizz's lyrics, you will understand that he is always talking about his relationship with God, the kind of things God does for him, how wonderful God has been in his life and the rest. It's something that everybody can actually relate to. So when you hear sounds like that, sounds like um, uh, you are great, as Lord, you are great, and um, sounds like... Um, uh, what they call it, Miracle No the Tire, Jesus, Daddy with a Pampa, um, sounds like um, it's a flow. And now, yes, before I go further, he has actually released another new sound. Yes, he released that on, um, he released that today, being Friday. He released um, Umbrella featuring um, some spotlight or all the spotlight artists and two extras which is the um Wachiku membrane and Godfrey Gad. Godfrey Gad has actually been with him for a very long time and Wachiku membrane was actually someone that was part of those that sang bigger every day with Moses Bliss. So I mean go and check out the song. Umbrella is a wonderful wonderful song. It's another banger it's another hit. It came out today. It's out on all digital streaming platforms. So Go and stream, go and share to your friends and go and be blessed. Go and dance, eh? Go and dance. You know, when you see songs with healthy lyrics, talking about God and, you know, things that promote God, anything that involves God, please be there. That is what we are in this life for. We are in this life to promote God, to, you know, to, to talk about our God, to brag about our God, to be proud about our God. You understand? So, when you do those things and, again, you surround yourself with people that think like you. Okay, so... You know, he is actually the um, CEO of Spotlight Nation. That's a record label. And yes, they've been thriving very, very well. His artists under him, they are superb. Yeah, he tried, I beg, he tried. You know, it takes someone that uh, is actually focused to achieve all that he has achieved at this time. And of course, Grace, Grace, G-R-A-C-E, that is it. The grace of God. You can never do anything and do it so well without the grace of God. No matter how much human effort minus God's grace is nothing. So the grace of God is actually speaking very loud in his life. Okay, so yeah, there was a time he shared the story about how uh, he wanted to join some record labels and then um, his pastor, which he, he also uses as his father, as a father figure in his life, actually advised him not to, you know, accept those offer. And right now he's paying off for him. He has his own record label now and he's doing fine. He's doing well. We are not hearing stories that touches about him. You understand? It's just banga, 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 nice, nice music. When it comes to worship songs, he's awesome. When it comes to, you know, hip-hop beats afro and everything it's beautiful and wonderful his lyrics are always meaningful you get and that as also uh you know the people he actually um, brought into his record label too they also have beautiful sounds like that okay yes and perfect lyrics writing that's one thing i love about spotlight nation record um 
artists they are very much doing well for themselves and yes they're making the kingdom proud okay so moses blaze actually announced it was this year that moses blaze broke the hearts of so many people yeah we heard that so many people were crying and the rest it's normal it's normal it's okay because some people were actually dreaming of being his wives but you know he can't marry everybody so it's just one person he got married to marie so it was this year 2024 he announced that he was engaged and um, of course he brought a song for life oh my god that lyrics is Mwah. and so after then in march he actually had his wedding and since then it's been awesome between he and his wife um yes they've been together now since then up until now and god is wonderful and the fact that he actually went to you know People do, did not expect, or will I say, we generally did not expect that that was the kind of a lady he was going to get married to. You know, we were thinking, oh, it's going to be all these, you know, all these or more outside, outside, outside ladies. But yeah, he got married to a very calm and reserved, God fearing, well brought up lady, very beautiful nice king column like everything about her is just so beautiful and you know the fact that she respects him and the fact that she compliments his ministry is one thing that is very very nice so whenever you want to get married you have to look for somebody that that is in alignment with god's will and god's purpose for your life not somebody that when you're up there the person is somewhere in the middle and is trying to pull you down or the person is trying to say no we can't go this way you know you guys are now together as one and imagine where you people are bounded together with something and then this other person wants to go left and the other person is going right like the the bond is gonna break and it's not nice so the fact that he went ahead to choose someone or let's say god chose someone that it's actually very okay for him. They blend, they fit, they're okay in alignment, in spirituality, in dreams and visions. They're just okay. Yeah, she's a lawyer. And uh, that's so beautiful to see and to hear. And yes, he has actually been uh, someone that has, you know, been... Uh, meddling with other artists like other people from other places and we're so sure that he's learning the fact that he's even close to a whole lot of pastors shows that you know he has this um, father figures around him people he can actually go to to you know uh, talk about and the rest yes he's actually a giver he gives a whole lot we've seen so many times say he gave he gave uh, cards to his people uh he blessed this person and so person with this he's always wanting to support people in one way or the other you know there are some leaders that would always just want the shining to be for themselves alone but he's not like that and we're so grateful to god for him we are so grateful to god for his life and we pray that god's oil god's grace will never depart from him he would always continue to go from grace to grace even as he carries others are under him along god will give him the grace to be a wonderful leader and all so we celebrate moses place today and once again i want to say go and stream umbrella it's out on all platforms it will bless your life thank you so much for listening to me